now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Have the lightning tracker turned on and we have some lightning strikes and storms off the coast of Cape Cod. Get a close-up look. Uh, some of these showers and the rumble of thunder came through a few locations this afternoon. They were quick hitters and they were rather scattered and just a brief interruption earlier this afternoon. But further off to the west, it is dry and sunny, so the chance for any additional showers is pretty much gone and out to sea. So drier air for this evening and overnight. Some showers still in the forecast for part of the upcoming weekend. We'll talk about that in just a second. And then turning cooler, actually starting Sunday on into next week, uh, of course temperatures have been on the mild side of late, but we do see signs of cooler weather down the road. A blend of fair weather clouds and sunshine in downtown Providence, warm, dry, and breezy all the way up to 78 degrees with a west-northwest breeze at 15. Humidity levels have really dropped off in the last couple of hours courtesy of that cool front, the leading edge of, well, not so much cooler air, but drier air. You can see along the south shore, there's still a bit of a component of wind off the water, so it's cooler from Narragansett, Newport, and Tiverton. Inland areas away from any ocean influence, Coventry, Johnston, and Cumberland are now well into the uh, mid and upper 70s. Smithfield, 73. Here in Providence, 78. Mid and upper 60s along the south shore, but at least we have some sunshine, so a, a decent finish to the day. You can see that quick little line of showers that came through early this afternoon are racing out to sea courtesy of this, uh, we'll call, call it a dry front rather than a cold front, drier air and some gusty northwesterly breezes behind it will be clearing out the skies for this evening. So for this evening, really no problem. 7 o'clock at 72, 11 o'clock we drop off to 63 degrees, sunset time at 746, clear skies overnight, very cool. Temperatures dropping to the upper 40s to around 50 by 5 o'clock in the morning. We're waking up to sunshine for your Friday. Kids heading out to school in the morning, temperature around 56 degrees. And then during the afternoon, real pretty. Several degrees cooler than today, but still mild. Temperatures upper 60s to low 70s by 3 o'clock with lots of sunshine. No threat of any showers. Here it is in more detail for your Friday afternoon. Uh, mid to upper 60s along the south shore to the lower 70s inland. A very comfortable day. Lots of sunshine. Dry air with a west-southwesterly breeze between 10 and 15 miles per hour. And looking good across the Cape and the islands. Temps in the 60s. New Bedford close to 70. Taunton sunshine and a temperature near 70. Warm and humid for Saturday with scattered showers and some thunderstorms. I'm going to watch this closely. Some of these thunderstorms could be locally strong uh, sometime on Saturday afternoon. It does cool off from Mother's Day Sunday, brisk, blustery, and temperatures only at 60, but at least it's dry on Mother's Day with some sunshine, but a very windy day. High temp only 61. That cool and dry weather extends into early next week. A nice day coming up tomorrow and uh, kind of a of a half and half weekend with uh, Sunday uh, being the drier day and temperatures in the uh, lower 60s. So cool for Mother's Day, but at least it's not raining. Okay, thanks, Tony.